Welcome to Look Smarter Than You Are with Oracle Business Analytics, BI Publisher for SBase. Parameters in your MDX query. So why have parameters in BI Publisher, especially with SBase? Well, we're able to actually leverage multiple reports from the same data and layout template. And when we're using the slicer or the POV from the MDX editor, it does not display the member that we selected in the data. So how do we parameterize their MDX? Well, it's really in five simple steps. First, we set the slicer or the point of view in the MDX query editor. Second, we edit the MDX and put a placeholder for that parameter. Third, we create a list of values, sort of a menu for the user to select from. Fourth, we create a parameter and bind that to the list of values. And finally, we test our data template. In the query editor, you can see when we bring market to this point to the slicer and point of view, we're actually given a member selection screen. This is what we're going to use as our values when we go into creating our parameter and our list of values. So we take note. We're going to keep it at the market and then the region level. We edit the MDX and we put a flag into the WHERE clause. In this case, the dollar sign French brace P underscore market closing French brace. This is cr called creating a bind variable or bi a bind parameter. When we hit OK in the editor, we're asked to at least put a default value. Here we will put the top of the dimension hierarchy market. When we create the list of values for the MDX query, we have to do it manually. With relational databases, we could actually execute a SQL query to get the values. In this case, we are going to create a list of values called LOV underscore region. It will be fixed data, and here we will type in the display to what the user is going to pick from and then the actual value that it's going to be pa passed to the MDX. To mirror or to mimic the hierarchy I'm using a dash and a space to create a step in for the regions. Next we create the parameters and we link the list of values from our region into this parameter. We create a parameter calling it pmarket to match our MDX edit. We're passing a string. Our default value will be the top of the hierarchy market. It will be a menu type parameter. We give it a display label to tell the person what to select and we link it to our list of values that has been previously created. Next we, dis we tell it how many we'd like it to display in our list uncheck any other options about passing multiple values and we're not going to have our parameter drive another parameter so we'll leave that unchecked as well. We test it. So when we go to view data in BI Publisher data model template editor we see that the top of the screen will have select market region just as our parameter was showing and then the, the options that we have chosen to display so as we pick market, we see that the P market is showing up at the top of our data set. And this will become a field that we can bring into our report. Had we not parameterized our POV slicer, we would not know what was selected. Here's a view of us choosing east.